Hello. Um, how is everyone today? Um, this is Sandra from Sandra Crafty Mom. And I wanted to share today, um, I um, joined this collaboration and we're all in this collaboration together. Uh, me, my world in OKC, and um, Cheryl, and I don't remember the name of her channel, but I will um, add a link down below. And I wanted to share, um, we were doing the Use Your Stamps collab because I, just like Tammy have and uh, Cheryl do, we have so many stamps that we haven't used and they're all brand new and maybe some I've used once, but many I haven't used at all. I bought them with a purpose. I fell in love with them and just never got around to using them. So today, I think I've put this stamp away already because as I'm using my stamps, I'm also cataloging them. Um, Tammy, um, I had mentioned to her, and she's going to share the video, but I had shared with her how I how I um, organize my stamps, and she really loved the idea. And I had done it. I had um, organized them and gotten to, like, stamp set number, like, 115. And then I was kind of lollygagging and wasn't getting very much done. So once I shared it with her and she got all excited about it, then I got excited about starting up again and continuing and I'm going and cataloging them quicker. So anyhow, I'm also cataloging them as I'm using them and it's very exciting to me because I love all the stamps that I've purchased. I um, purchased for a purpose and um, just life got busy, sidetracked and just didn't continue. But I had this stamp, and it's a little boy with a puppy. He's really, really cute, and he is from um, MFT. And I stamped him out once, and then I stamped him out a second time, and I made a card with him. And on the inside, it says, we'll, we'll, we'll oops, sorry, I promise I haven't been drinking. It's too early in the day. No wine or anything like that. We'll always be friends. And then I put three little sequins up here. And then here is a little area for a note um, in this card. And I love this um, die set that I cut this out with. It doesn't have a name or anything. I It's probably the, it's actually the only thing I've ever bought in the D stash on YouTube was this die. And it cuts out the outside and makes it into a card. And then it has the little scallop on the inside. And I love this die, and I used it a couple of times, but then it kind of went by the wayside. So I took out, made this card, and not, and in the back here, I'm going to put my little sticker created by Sandra Crafty Mom, and that's going to go down here. I printed up these stickers on sticker paper, and that's something else that Tammy convinced me to do because I was just really dragging my feet on that. So that is one of the stamps that I used. And this one's gonna I'm gonna send it to someone to um, when the time comes, when we're ready, when when we're all done, gonna send them out uh, in happy mail and share them with um, some friends. And then the rest of the stamps that I've stamped, I stored them away in this envelope. And these are only the sets, th these are the sets that I'm gonna send out, the ones that I that I, the second one that I stamped out for myself, I've actually used some of them already. So I um, either I've used them or I put them aside. But I stamped two images of each stamp and I wish I would have kept the stamp sets out. I did not. I have this little stamp, which is a little flower to color in, which it's going to be part of my ones I share and this one as well smile you've got happy mail and I may make some projects with some of these so that the person people that I send them to I might send them to more than one person has uh, maybe a completed project too apart from that she doesn't have to um, color or work on or anything just receive it and use it and then some of them I'll leave blank so that they can color it in and use it in their projects and there's this butterfly. There's these little 
um, like little squiggles. And I did, I fussy cut these all out. I did not have dies for these, but I enjoy cutting. So one day when I was watching TV and during the commercials, I just took my time and cut these out. And this one is another one. I think this is a Unity stamp. If, if I remember the name of the, the brand, then I'll mention it. But this is a Unity stamp. And look how cute those little birdhouses are for spring. And I've started making a project with that one, if I'm not mistaken, with the one that I printed out for myself. And here's another one of those um, squiggles. And if I can remember, I will come back when I do my next, if, when I do my more, more stamping, then I'll go ahead and save the stamp so I can share the stamp set in case you might want to go look for it. it these are, most of them are really old stamps that, I've, that I have, or so, most of them are fairly old, not all of them, but you might be interested in looking for them. And then this one, I'll try to remember, oh, my brain is so bad. And then there's this one where the little hedgehogs, I think it's called hedgehog something and uh, sends mail or something like that because they're putting mail in the in the mail and um, it's so cute the bottom one is helping the top one put their letter in and then the bottom one has a little gift that they're going to help each other put in the box after afterwards so that one I think it's cute this is the taco dog and he is an MFT stamp and I did make a project with him already with my copy of, or my stamp that I, the copy that I made for myself. And look at this little fella. He's so cute. Little chihuahua. Chihuahua. Yeah. This is the taco dog actually in the taco outfit. Isn't he adorable? I thought he was so cute. And last but not least, I had this stamp and I, want to, I don't want to say what I want to say because definitely don't want uh, anybody on YouTube to get upset about my choice of words. But just picture what these two things look like. It's a part of the anatomy that is on your backside. These are supposed to be, I know, three scoops of ice cream. But when I first got the stamp, I never wanted to use it because that's all that I would see when I stamped it. Or not when I stamped it, because I this is the first time I stamp it. But when I when I wanted to stamp it, I wanted to take it out and I would see that and I would like, no, I'm gonna put it away. I'm not gonna use it. And now I've stamped it and I am going to color my the stamp set that I made for me, I'm gonna color in some nice ice cream colors to um, maybe take that image out of my mind. And those are my um, use your stamps, my collaboration. Uh, share for use your stamps. This is the first my first video and I will put it up as soon as I'm ready as soon as the time comes I will go ahead and share it here in um, in a little bit and then I will see you all next week with my um, second set of stamps that I've used and um, if I make any projects that I'm going to share um, when I'm done that I'm going to send out I will show them in my next video if uh, again if I remember but I just have it marked here collaboration stamped images so that way I can just put it there and when I stamp my images I save them here and that way they um, don't get misplaced but anyhow that is it for my share for today I will be back again for my uh, share number two um, next week and I will see you all then. If you have any questions or if there's any stamp that you absolutely need to know what it is because you really really like the image, shoot me a, a comment down below and um, I will uh, locate the stamp because now they're all the ones I've used are cataloged so I should be able to find them fairly easy. And I don't want to share my cataloging system because I shared it with Tammy from My World in OKC and she was so excited about it. I said, sure. I've been using the that I've been using that system for since like 2016 and I haven't shared it with anybody. I just didn't think it was really a big deal. And she was like so excited about it.
that she um, is going to share that with you all in a video that she um, that she makes. I said, yeah, go ahead and share it. Others can benefit from it as well, and maybe they'll find it useful. All right, well, that is all that I have for today. You all have a great day. Thanks for watching and hanging out with me, and I will see you again in the next video. Bye.